Carrera, presidente del Grupo Amistad India México en la Cámara de Diputados. Honorado Diplomático Corps, India México y México. Good afternoon, everyone. Eh, con el permiso del presidente de la Cámara de Diputados, saludo a todos los funcionarios del Gobierno de México. First, first of all, I would like to thank the Embassy of Bajarat, India, in Mexico, and especially my friend, the Ambassador Pankaj Sharma, for giving me the pleasure of being here and speaking to you. I'm honored to celebrate the day of the Republic of Bajarat, India a vibrant and diverse country with a rich history and culture. It is also a democracy with a long and proud tradition of freedom. Mexico and Bajarat India have a long history of friendship and cooperation. Our two countries share many common values, including democracy, respect, and human rights, and a commitment to economic development. In recent years, Our relationship has grown stronger than ever. We have expanded trade and investment ties, and we have strengthened our cooperation on a wide range of issues, including technology, security, climate, climate change, and education. I'm proud of the progress that we have made in building a strong relation between Mexico and Bajarat India. I believe that our two countries have a bright future together. As a member of Mexican Congress, I am committed to working to strengthen our ties with Bajarat India, and I believe that it is important for our two countries to work together to promote peace, prosperity, democracy in the world. On, one, on this special day, I would like to extend my warmest congratulations to the people of Bajarat India, a place where many have found the single purpose of life, like Octavio Paz, Mexican diplomat and Nobel Prize, who claimed he had understood the world and found his soul by being ambassador in India. He said, India put me in front of another civilization. It was a singular experience like looking in a mirror and seeing another person appear who is also a stranger to yourself. Thus, it forced me to face myself. I would like, I would also like to highlight that the Constitution of India is a remarkable document and an example for every free country of the world. It is a symbol of the strength of Indian democracy and, a, and of the commitment of the Indian people to freedom and equality. I'm proud that Mexico and India share a common commitment to democracy. And I truly believe that our two countries can work together to promote it and to promote human rights around the world. Thank you again for the opportunity to speak today. And I do not think of a better way to close than by quoting one of the people that I most admire, Baba Saheb Ambedkar, the father of the Indian Constitution. He said, a constitution is not a mere lawyer's document. It is a vehicle of life, and its spirit is always the spirit of age. Namaste. Muchísimas gracias, Dr. Cabrera, por, sus, por su atento mensaje. Y bueno, pues ahora agradecemos la participación de las autoridades que nos acompañan en esta celebración y los invitamos a pasar al frente del escenario para disfrutar nuestra, nuestra presentación cultural. <tose> 